Okay, what's up everybody? Today we're back again with another video. We're going to be going back out here on Parque Fernanda, where we haven't been since the Axis tier update, or the true Axis tier update. And we're going to still try and avoid the Axis tier, just because they are actually still broken, but... I decided we're gonna make it 9 30 in the morning and just try and see what we can find in terms of black buck or mule deer and just to kind of see if we can start getting some respawns ready because we will need one of each of those species or a diamond with the bow so i thought why don't we start that out today i haven't been on here for a while because it was avoiding the access deer like i said but decided to hop back on today but before we get started, if you do enjoy this video, please do make sure that you press that like button. And if you're new around here and you enjoy the content, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon so you're always notified when I upload new videos just like this. But without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. So we have our first group here and we actually have a... Um, oh, max weight one. What is that back there? Okay, we have two big muter here. I'm surprised about this. Uh, wrong gun. Let's get out the M1. Let's see. I'd love to get both of them, but I think that's going to be very hard. But let's just try and do that. And then hopefully he's just going to run forward. Of course he isn't. We've got another big four back there. Like, how many of these do we have? And sorry that I had to cut that other part shortly there. My dog just decided to go off. But we have three max weight estimate mule deer down and looks like we actually got all of them so let me mark him and then let's look if we can maybe find the first two that we shot here i don't think we got a good shot on the second one though but i guess we'll have to see uh, i do see some blood tracks here already so um okay this is the one that we didn't hit vitally but it was medium blood so i do think that we got something decent and there is the one we shot badly down. He didn't run really far. And thinking about it, it would have probably been smarter picking up the other ones first and then going for him. But 254, male, common for variation. Pretty wide rack, but nothing too crazy. Still a good bit away from diamond. So hopefully we can get some better ones. I think the last one that we shot had a higher estimate. But look, you can see he did run pretty far even with an intestine hit. So the other one, sh one of them is definitely there. And then the other one is probably somewhere in that region there. And here's the third one that we shot. And yeah, so this one's quite a bit bigger at 274. Also a lot heavier, but he's got kind of a similar rack shape, just wider, but just looks a lot more like the diamond rack. If these were going down, it would have been the diamond rack, but he needs to be a little bit wider as well. So he's close, but just not close enough sadly and then our first one should be back here if i'm not mistaken he should lie in this general area because this is where we also saw the second one's blood and yeah he is just down right over here let's look 253 so similar score to the second one we shot but very different rack i do prefer this one a lot more than the wide ones but that's just my personal preference. I just like the, them being a bit thicker and looking more unique than just being wide and looking a little bit more like white tails, in my opinion. But I don't know. I think they did an amazing job with the mule deer. Just obviously they were a little bit bugged at the beginning with those sixes and sevens spawning in. But that all should be fixed now once you actually kill all of them. But there was an issue as well with the fours not spawning often, but clearly that does not seem to be an issue right now we found three fours in like two zones so i assume that that is fixed but i don't know you guys could let me know in the comments if you actually have any any issues with that anymore or if it seems to also be fixed for you and we have our first black buck just a female so not gonna bother about that but with that let me just look down through here i think i should have some more zones down there and maybe some black buck over on that side but we're gonna have to go ahead and look i haven't really hunted too many black bucks in this game if i'm honest i think i have one diamond about of them which was like from playing the map the first time but that was just about it i never actually actively hunted them too too much got another four it's not a 
max uh, weight estimate one, but it's a four, so I do like getting those for respawns as well. There is a good three with it as well, but I don't think with the way that that tree is there, I don't think we're gonna get a good shot in there. So oh, we got a bad hit on that four as well. Um, since we messed it up anyways, I was gonna try and get three shots in, but doesn't seem like we're gonna get lucky there. So we might have to track that guy a little bit, but I always like getting the fours and obviously it was the fives down first, just because usually those tend to come back as better respawns, but in terms of weight estimate, it actually really didn't matter there who we got because it would have all ended up as in a somewhat equal chance of them coming back as something bigger or something smaller. So got some threes there so why don't we try and get both those down as well then we're gonna have tier three hunting pressure there and we're gonna be fine because we don't have anything else but we just have to be careful then if we do see anything big back there that we don't accidentally create tier four hunting pressure over one of the zones but i think we should be fine here is one of the mulier so i think this would have been the second one that we shot just a three like i said but double lunged it nothing crazy just the silver nothing really to worry about too much then here's the track for the last one that we shot and i just saw as well that the first one that we shot did go down so we are going to track that down but i like these guys i like this track it's just the silver sadly but i like these kind of stickers coming out here i just think it looks cool and unique because usually they're like on different positions on the antler so it makes them just a bit more versatile i guess if that's the right word it just makes them look a little more a little bit more unique and different to each other which i think is always good i don't like if they all look the same so that's that's one other plus thing that's obviously always going to come with two racks they're all going to look a little bit different the diamonds usually look pretty similar but we can only hope that in the future maybe we can get a little bit more rack variety for those different like diamonds so depending on where they score there's usually always a big rack and a small rack but it would be nice to see maybe having like a like a two small racks and two large racks in that sense and maybe like a medium rack for diamonds just to have a little bit more variety but i know it's difficult and they should maybe they, should, they said they're focusing on the bugs first these are just like small small things in my opinion like having different racks is nice obviously but it's it, it's more important that the game is playable and that the community is happy about the game and how it's going and those kinds of things they can be changed later but let me find this mulder now and stop rambling on about the different racks and here he is he actually didn't get that far it's like 200 250 meters something like that but 235 so he would have been a gold and we just shot too low okay i thought it was more like 240 meters but it ended up being 260 so we were just too low probably would have been better off zeroing for 300 but it wouldn't have been anything special anyway and we're just going to use that for respawns sadly in terms of black buck i haven't really f seen too many i've only seen females so far not a single male but maybe i'm just at the wrong lake maybe they moved so why don't we go over here look if we have something at this lake because i know this used to be a good black buck lake and a pretty decent mule lake at that as well but look just a female it seems like another female oh three there not a big one but we might just get him there's another male back there but yeah i'll have a look around and if there's anything bigger than that three we're gonna go for it but other than that i think it's gonna be the biggest thing that we can find so there's our three 260-ish uh, out, so let's just aim really high. And okay, there's a tree in the way. Uh, see, that's, that's one thing about parquet. I, I I always underestimate those those tree hitboxes. But there's another tree there, so why don't we just try going for him? Didn't we hit anything? Um, don't think we did. Oh, there's a lot more black buck there than I thought. Oh, what's that? Oh, no, why did I press? Oh, man. 
pressed the wrong button. I was trying to press E, but I accidentally hit R to reload. So there was something big in there. Not diamond size, but definitely big. So I might look around there for tracks. It probably was something like a big four, maybe even a small five, but definitely not big enough to be diamond. And there we have our max weight four. So that was the guy probably that we heard the mating call off of at the beginning. He's not too big, but I mean, for respawns, I will definitely want to try and take him out. He is standing <laughs> very bad, but why don't we try and go for that? Let's look. Did we hit him? Okay, we got something good at least because he is down. But let's follow this other three first and then come back and pick him up. Here is our first black buck. Very small. Very, very, very small. Just a 23 scoring. Not even big enough to be gold. Needed another 5.3 points to make diamond and another 1.7 points to make gold. So very small black buck, but hopefully worth something in terms of respawns for the future. And this is why you place tents, because now I don't have to walk those 500 meters or whatever it was to pick up this four here. Okay, well, apparently we can't see our black buck, but I have the confirmed trophy here, and I don't see him anywhere. So why don't we just pick him up? And the game crashed. Perfect. Let me get back into it and be right back. Okay, we are back now, and we moved on to the next part of the big lake. We got um a big one here it seems like so a four max weight estimate um i don't think it's max score estimate because i don't think that even is capable of making diamond but i do want to get him down for the simple reason of respawns and we're going to try and get just one other one as well just so we can get some more black buck respawns because every animal is obviously going to help but you could see that I have a ton and ton of females. Now there's a couple more males. I don't know where they were hiding, but from the perspective that I was looking at it just now, there just seemed to be an abomination of females here. But clearly I did not look closely enough because there are a lot of males in there as well. So I should remember this spot and come back here. Here is our four. I mean, he doesn't look bad, honestly. He does look pretty good, but... How close was he? Okay, he was uh, 1.5 away from diamond, so he couldn't have made it anyway, just because his highest estimate was 27, I think, if I saw that right, or remember that right? I think it was 27, and yeah, they need a little over 28 to make diamond. Let's look, do we have any diamond teals flying over us as well? Doesn't look like it, so let's look where our other one went. Um, here it is. Didn't vitally hit it, but it did go down. Now, just quickly really going back to what happened just before, uh, we didn't see that black bug that we shot down and couldn't pick it up, and I decided to still try and pick it up, which ended up causing the game to crash. So, I hope that doesn't happen again, but... It, it will at some point happen again. Let's look. Can I get... Um... Uh, that was a terrible hit again there again. But what I was saying is... Oh, jeez. I'm about to be run over here. Nope. Please don't kill me, Black Bucks. I still want to pick this guy up. Um, but what I was going to say is just... If you don't want your game to crash... Or you still have a diamond... That you have to pick up somebody somewhere else... Uh, try... Picking the diamond up first when oh, there's a big four again. I'm just gonna go with the M1 just so we make sure it's gonna go down. And of course, we didn't hit the right one. Uh, come on, there we go. Uh, I might delete my zone here, and of course, <laughs> we flew down. But uh, I might delete my zone here, like I was saying. Actually, I think we're gonna be good. I think we're gonna be fine. Let's just look where those guys went, because I saw one of them down as well. So we did sadly delete our zone now, but doesn't look like we're going to have to run far to pick these guys up. We're going to get the zone back anyway, because this is a very popular spot for 
Meteor and Black Buck, Black Buck in general. So I think that we're going to get a zone probably like over there. Might just mean we have to move the tent back a little bit, but should be fine. I don't think that zone would have moved too far. Of course, uh, it's not the best thing if I delete zones, but we should be fine in the long run. And I don't want to create now extra hunting pressure. But it seems like they're both down somewhere here. Uh, yeah, look, he's down there. And then the other one that we tried getting while running towards us is right here. So got him. And the other one is just right over there. And did we get another one? Oh, yeah, I remember we shot two. Never mind. So this, I think, is the max weight estimate for Yeah, Pretty good as well, but interesting pose. That is an interesting pose to be shot in, but I'll take it. And where is the last one? Okay, there is the other one that we shot by accident while we tried to brain shot the other four. So why don't we pick him up? What did he was? He was... How did we hit him? We must have gone through the air or something like that. But yeah, I'm going to check one more spot. Because this lake over here, I was just there. Didn't see anything great. Like nothing at all. And it just all ran away. So why don't we check down here? Because I know I had a really big builder spot. Uh, either it was back there or it's over there. I think though it's back there. So we might have to walk just a little bit until we see it but i used to have like 15 20 milder here so i still hope that that zone is there because i haven't hunted here for a very long time so to finish off we got one more group of milder back here uh i do have to stand on the water right now because i'm being attacked by uh orange water buffalo but why don't we try and get oh i don't know if we hit that guy good um i know we hit that guy good i mean he's down oh what was that it's just a three that looked like a, a decent four but he's not going down uh, unless we just dropped him which could be the case but yeah see he's very aggressive at me right now so i might have to hurry up uh, i hope he's not faster than us but let me go ahead pick those guys up and see if we maybe got ourselves a gold out of at least one of them. Well, here is our mule. The other one, I didn't think it died. The honey pressure just stayed at one. So I don't think he's going to go down, sadly. And we're probably going to get killed by that water buffalo. But let's pick him up. Sadly, just the silver. But we did end up getting liver and right lung on him. So he is that small rack again. I mean, he's the one that's... We saw the one with the stickers earlier, but like you saw, I think we had almost a different rack on every single mule deer today, which is pretty cool. We found a couple of nice black bucks as well, but that is going to be it for today. If you guys did enjoy the video, please do make sure to smash that like button. And in the comment section, remember to tell me where you have some more black buck spots that I didn't go over in today's video because I will would like to look at all of them and try and find ourselves a diamond with the bow. Also, if you haven't done yet or are new around here, please do make sure to smash this subscribe button and hit the bell icon so you're always notified when I upload new videos or I live stream. And if you haven't done so, also make sure to click that link in the description down below. Yeah, it will bring you to my Discord server. I'd love to have you and we're starting competitions today. We're starting off with some turkeys. I will make that channel there and love to see you. But with that being said, have a good day. Bye bye and peace.